Hi team. In this video, we're going to be talking about why the cash flow statement is so important. In any business, cash is essential to survival. Michael Dell captures this perfectly by comparing cash to gasoline, because you can light up a club with either. Terrible joke. Here's why. We were always focused on our profit and loss statement, but cash flow was not a regularly discussed topic. It was as if we were driving along, watching only the speedometer, when in fact we were running out of gas. Why pay attention to Michael Dell? It turns out that by the age of 21, he was running a business that made $60 million a year. And then by the age of 27, he was the youngest CEO of a Fortune 500 company. His estimated net worth is approximately $50 billion. And finally, he happens to be someone I consider a great friend. Back to the quote, though. Cash is the gasoline to your business's engine. When I ask friends and peers that work in the investment industry, what single skill they look for in a junior hire, the answer I most frequently hear is the desire to work for 54 consecutive hours, coupled with the ability to determine how any change in the financial statements affects cash. And the reason is simple. On a long enough time horizon, cash is the most fundamental component of value. Even when a business is valued off of a multiple of revenue, the underlying assumption is that revenue will create cash flow. Now, occasionally markets get crazy and people stop doing math. As I speak these words, Dogecoin is about to orbit the moon with a valuation that has surpassed $50 billion. If humans fall for one thing consistently, it's bubbles and get-rich-quick narratives. In the past, people have been willing to consider everything from sardines to Beanie Babies a store of value. Most of the time, however, if it doesn't consistently generate cash flow, it will disappoint. There are, of course, exceptions. Gold, now cryptocurrencies, art, and even some fancy cars. Even the Hermes Birkin bag has been considered a good investment. In a July 2017 research report released by BagHunter.com, the Birkin bag was shown to outperform both the S&P 500 and gold. The difference, however, between a store of value and an operating company that generates cash flow is that the former requires a growing population believe in it. An operating company, for so long as it's properly run, will consistently generate what is most useful to the largest population cash. In this lesson, we will spend little time talking about the mechanics of projecting the cash flow statement because this has been covered several times on a simplemodel.com. Instead, we will cover the theory behind the cash flow statement and explain how it balances the model. We will also explore differences between the income statement and the cash flow statement to really emphasize why cash is king. All right, team, that's all for now. Thanks for watching.